Hello everyone, this is Moot, and this is the uh, next episode of our first hour in Worm series. Let's go ahead and reset our timer. Reset counter, and I really don't like third person. Hey, I said reset, restart, there you go. And so I'm going to change it, go to the settings, and I'm going to go to advanced settings. I'm going to scroll down. I don't like third person because I, I think it, it doesn't let you view all that you need to do. All right, so we made our plank, and now we're going to run back to the newbie instruction guide. And you see how I'm running kind of slow? You look at my speed, 8.35 kilometers per hour. Well, I want to actually drop some weight. So see this olive log? I don't need this because it's 1.40. Or better yet, you see all these wood scraps? Whenever you make pieces of planks, you have wood scraps. Let's go ahead and right click on that and go down to drop and we're gonna drop it on the ground. And it drops somewhere here. Where did it drop? Okay, well, it's all right, we'll have more. So I dropped it and now you'll see my weight. If I click on C, my carrying weight, I have 44 is my total weight. So I'm still going only 75%. That's okay. We're going to go, 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 go. What do we start with? A hatchet, carving knife, steel and flint, pottery bowl for cooking food in, shovel, saw, axe, rake. All right, coming into the newbie guide, we're gonna right click on him. We're gonna receive instructions. Now go and use a pickaxe on some rock to get the feel of mining. Select, select tunnel, which eventually will open up into the mountain. You may find valuable ore inside a mountain, even the precious gems. If you find ore, you may smelt it in the fire and use the iron to create an anvil of nails. So this is not intuitive at all, actually. It, does, it misses an entire step where you have to actually create a mallet in order to create an anvil. But let me show you that because this is not a good one. So I will do this. Okay, send. Thank you. Uh, I need to go mine some iron. Now, conveniently enough, we already have a mine for you. Let's go ahead and if you south of um, the starter deed. So this is gonna be south. I know this because I'm familiar with the deed. All these little holes up here are mines and there's a newbie mine right there and we're gonna run towards that. Okay, just stay on the road. Don't detour, don't get eaten by wolves. Okay, just stay on the road. Boop, boop, you're gonna run faster on the road. And let's go ahead and drop this log here. We're gonna come up to the dirt, we're gonna right click. We're going to go drop, Oop, drop, drop on ground. All right, there you go. I don't need that in my inventory. Okay, we're running on the road. We're going to the newbie mine up there. You see the newbie mine? That's what we're running towards. The newbie mine. We've got six minutes to do this. So going back to what we started off on, uh, a pickaxe. You're going to need a pickaxe to mine, obviously. Uh, a rake to farm, a rope. Uh, to lead an animal, okay? Uh, a compass to know you're barren. Here's the compass right here. Uh, in order to know what your bearings are, you actually have to stop and let it reset for 15 seconds, okay? And then it will actually tell you which way you're facing. You start off with a tent. You can go ahead and drop the tent if you right click, drop on ground. That's kind of like if you die and you're out in the wilderness. Um, that's where you respond. Now they only last about a real life day out outside before they decay. You can go ahead and right click on it, open it, and you can store stuff like your pumpkins and like your planks. And no one can steal it from you. But um, let's not worry about that. Okay, let's go ahead and pick it back up. Right click, take, and it's back of our inventory. You can drag and drop through inventories, through most inventories, just by opening both windows and then dragging and dropping it. So we're going to the newbie mine. What's that sign if I hover? Public water. Oh, that's nice. So if I, I run out of water, oh, there's a well. You can go there and get a piece of water. That's nice. Well, we're going to go to the mine. We're going to follow the road all the way up. Oh, there's our little forge. We're following the road all the way up to this mine all the way up to the mine running slow S 
slower than expected. Okay, here's our public mine. Okay, this mine is protected for new players. GM zip. Here we go. Down into the you enter the cave. Okay. Now it can't really see it very well, but if you just kind of put your cursor over one of the cave tiles, okay, one of them is a cave wall, this one's reinforced, and the other one is an iron vein. Iron vein is where you get iron, okay? This one is a, just a regular cave wall, and you can see here people have already mined, so if you right click on this pile and open, people have already mined uh, all this ore, okay? The QL quality, the higher the quality, the better the ore. Okay, if it has damage, it has zero in this column, but if it had damage, you take that damage and subtract it. Um, su subtract the damage, or take the quality and subtract the damage, and that will give the actual real quality with a uh, minimum of one. So you can have 90 damage and only five quality. Well, it's still only gonna, gonna turn out to be a one quality or one quality item. But let's go ahead and mine our own, okay? Let's go ahead and mine our own. Let's come over here to this side, see how it created a little pile of items. Right click on that, let's open it. What do we got here? We got ore, we got iron lumps. Okay, we can open that. Someone dropped a crude knife and pickaxe, a pickaxe. That's kind of rude. Let's go ahead and clean this place up. Uh, we're gonna open both of these, okay? Oh, you know what, I just used a hotkey, sorry. Uh, let's right click, let's open, let's drag it off to the side. Let's right click, let's open, drag it off to the side. I'm just going to click that and we're going to drag it over to that pile. Perfect. Now, in all one pile, in one pile, you can only have 100 items. Okay, that's the general rule of thumb. In your inventory, you can only have 100 items at a time. You can put items inside different containers, like if I want to put the flint and steel in this bowl. Okay, I can open the bowl or, un, you know, um, open the bowl, I guess that's a correct word, and I can go ahead and drag it out. Okay, let's go ahead and mine. we got two minutes left. Okay, I'm going to activate my pickaxe. Double click, activate, it's activated. I'm going to click on the iron ore, click, 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 click. I'm going to come up here and I can examine it. If I look at it, it just tells me it's a pure iron ore. I can track, I can mine straight, I can mine down, up. Or I can prospect. If I prospect, it's just going to tell me the higher prospect skill that you have, um, you can figure out what the quality of the ore is. But let's not worry about that. We're detouring. So let's go ahead and mine. Let's click a couple, couple times in there. Okay. And if I look down below me, this is where it's going to drop. Is right down here. I, okay, thanks. You should go see if there's more instructions. Let's right click. Let's open the ore and you can see that we're we're mining ore now wonderful i don't know where i got that 20 coin maybe you get that from uh doing the quests and perfect let's go ahead and take one of these now you can either right click take or you can click and drag it into your inventory all right and Let's go ahead and go back. So we're, we're carrying it. We're a little bit heavy. We got one minute and 30 seconds to make it back. I think we'll be able to make it. Maybe not actually. Let's, let's skip this. Let's go down the fast way. We're going down the fast way. We got one minute, eight seconds. Come on, buddy. Let's make it. We got to make it all the way over there. Look at those pretty white lights. That's how you can tell where you are in the starter deed or where the starter deed is. Just look for the white lights. Oh, look at this person. Nehru. Right click on him. Emotions. Let's go ahead and wave. Ha. You wave at him. Okay. All right. We got 40 seconds. Let's make it. Finish this video out. Let's go ahead and be rude. Offensive. Fart. Nice. <laughs> the juicy fart. Mexican salsa enchilada. Enchilada de pollo. 
We're sticking on the road. We're sticking on the road. Come on. Last minute. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. Attack the hill. That's what my football coach said. Attack the hill. Uh, uh, okay. We're going to be a little bit over. That's okay. We'll finish this out. Let's see what this guy says. There he is. Our newbie guide. Okay, we're going to right-click on him. Receive instructions. That's all. A, a few final advice. Try to find a bed when logging off and you're sleeping long enough. You'll invigorate and receive a bonus for a while. When you return, when it comes to fighting, I can't teach you that. Initially, just do as much as possible. Standing still, doing nothing, usually less effective. Good luck. Uh, thanks. I'm done here. You're about as useful as gonorrhea. Send. And Fast Learner, well, that completes the newbie tutorial, which is about as helpful as getting an STI. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next one.